up everyone watching on YouTube and welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Let's load back up the game. We're we're right in the thick of it. We're we're in the middle of a whole lot of shenanigans. Stuff is uh stuff is going less than ideal right now. Shulk is is dead. So now Dunban Dunban has to, you know, get the Monado back and become the Monado boy once again. He's just going to have to take over because he's the best character we have available pretty much at all times. Or or we can give Ricky the Monado. Hero Pond Monado boy. Micah, welcome to stream. What's up? Anyways, yeah, we got a lot of story stuff and uh, cutscenes, etc. to go through here. As I'm sure most all of us know, since this is an NG+, we've seen it all before. So we're going to start today by doing that, and then probably look at some side quest options and whatnot. And I'm uh, not sure if we're going to do the Bionis Interior today or not. I think we might, because the Bionis Interior is pretty short anyways. And also, we're going to need to, like, level up soon, like, up our levels to do a, a lot of the late-game quests. And I'd like to go through Bionis Interior without being overleveled. You know, we'll, uh, we'll see what happens, pretty much. For now, let's get the heck on up out of here before we all freaking die. Hey, guys, I'm home. Yo, Miko, we gotta get out of here, brother. We, we gotta go. We gotta go. Stubborn mortals. So desperate to cling to your pathetic lives. Even when there is no hope for you. For both our worlds, you must succeed, Lady Mayna. Conis. Thank you. <sighs> Look, Starboard. What's that cloud? Not getting away. Dixon! Listen, it's over. Time for you all to return to the Bionis. Nice and quietly. That's enough! Why, Dixon? What made you like this? Shulk looked up to you, respected you. Dixon! Don't let Zanza control you! Wake up! You can quit your belly aching. 
I'm in total control. I've always been like this, ever since long before any of you lot were born. Before we were born? Now you get it. It's just like Egil said. I'm Lord Zanza's disciple. Dixon of the Trinity! Dude, Egil's last moments in this game are so incredibly good. His whole, they will judge me not in life, but death. And, you know, hitting the, uh, hitting the Bionis at the last moment. So good. Great, great way for that character to go out, honestly. Big fan, big fan. Now, my boy Dixon, my boy Dixon, we gotta, we gotta stop you from being a little bit of a dick. Not gonna lie, should have seen it coming. Your name is Dixon, you're being a bit of a dick. Should have expected it. However, I do still love you. You're one of my favorite characters in this game. Excuse me, please get toppled. It appears that you're immune to topple. That's very rude, not gonna lie. Very rude of you. What if I were to just... I think you're going for soul read right now. What if I got enough... Whatchamacallsit to just kill you? Enough chain links to just end you dead. Dude, I'm going for the time... The chain max... Ah, uh, oh, never mind. I wanted chain max on my talent art, but then my chain links immediately ran out. Oh, Killer Sky. That's not the thing at all. Oh, I've been toppled. Fiora isn't supposed to be toppled. She's supposed to be the one who does the toppling. Aw, oh, now it's soul reading. Every Everything is going terribly now. This, this is all just very unfortunate. Excuse me, sir. Please stop dodging. Sir. 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 Yo, someone encourage me. Sir, stop this. First Animus. What the heck does... I've been sealed. Help. Help. I hope I've been toppled. The music is bad. Everything's going wrong. Ah, oh, cutscene. Thank you. <laughs> you waste of space. Not so tough without Shulk, eh? Stupid beast. You should be grateful. Not everyone has a war buddy like me to lead them along. Tasted good, didn't they? The victory drinks we used to share. I'll kill you! What? <sighs> Who was that? Show yourself! Melia, are you alright? Brother! Kalyan! Dixon! He works for the Bionis! He shot Shulk in the back! Is this true? Dixon? This ends here. Your Telethia are no match for our Havrez squadron. You cannot win! Maybe you should be concentrating on your own people instead of barking at me. <gasps> Looks like you've forgotten your destiny. Right? Lorathea? Lorathea? Are you involved in this as well? Your Highness, your naivety is quite charming, but it is also your undoing. <laughs> I had much fun playing with you and your father. What? What is this light? Ether particles emitted so that the Bionis can be destroyed and reborn. <laughs> what do you get if you cross high concentrations of ether with high entia? N no, you wouldn't. Lorathea! Awaken, my darling pets! Understand, child. This is the reason why High and Tear are born. Do not blame poor old me. Explain yourself. It's just like she says. 
The High Entia are a race created by Lord Zanza to eliminate any annoying life forms in the preparation for the rebirth of the Bionis. Their bodies contain a gene that, when the time comes, transforms them into telepia. It can't be. Say it isn't so. Melia, it is true. That is why you are our only hope. Brother? Whatever. We won't be needing a half-breed like you anyway. I mean... If you don't turn into a telepia, it just means you're going to get crushed by one. That's the only thing you're good for. <gasps> Rise up, pet. Do my bidding. Kill your lovely sister. <laughs> a tear to my eye. These moments are to be treasured. <gasps> How? Brother! Melia! Father's wish? And the future of the High Entia are in your hands. Yours and Shulk's. <gasps> Telethia, destroy him! Dixon! I got it. Too late? Damn him! Another really fan <clears throat> oh my goodness, something in my throat. Another really fantastic moment. Callion, love him. Really good side character. Big fan of Callion. Really just a huge fan of the reveal that like the High Entia turn into Telethia. It's one of my favorite twists in this game. Love it. Oh, now we're in space. Where am I? Oh. So I'm... <laughs> what was I doing? What was the purpose of my life? I like all these flashbacks still have the Monado 3 in them. No. I've got it wrong. I was never alive. It was Zanza. All along, I... Everything I did was... 
Do you want to say pointless? <gasps> that voice. <gasps> Nobody else can decide that. Only you. Nicole made you a wonderful new weapon. Since you lost your Monado, I mean. It uses the latest Machina technology. Use it when you wake up. Then, let's all go on living. Nicole made the Monado 3? You could just make those? We've relocated the Hyentia and the Nopon refugees to Colony 6. Hey, Atharon. What's up, brother? Scorp, welcome to stream. Griffin as well. How near is the game to the end? Uh, right now, we're in the biggest concentration of cutscenes at the very end of the game. There are two more areas to go through after this one, and then the game is over. Thankfully, the Mekon did us a favor by fortifying it for us. It should hold out for a while. It's ironic. We want to escape Zanza. But we can't leave his body, the Bionis. Well, this is our home. Princess, I have to know. Should we be worried about the evacuated Hyentia? I cannot be sure, but I believe not. All those who survived are part Homs like me. Understood. If they ever do transform, I will be among them. If that time comes, you know what to do. Are you sure? Everyone is obliged to accept their fate. No way. There's no way Callion would leave the fate of the Hyentia to you if that was going to happen. Precisely. And Melia, if we are to survive, we must fight Zanza and the Telethia. It may not be the case with all of them, but a large number of Telethia were once Hyentia. Your subjects and your brethren. I am prepared for that. Even if it means harming my brethren, it is for the protection of the survivors. That is the final wish of my father and brother. I will fight to free the soul stolen by Zanza. You're a fighter, Melia. We will need all your strength in the fight ahead. How Shulk? He's going to make it. His wound has closed. I think Maynith used the last of her power to protect him. So he's okay. Linada is tending to him now. Fiora? He won't wake up. It's like his consciousness has sunk to the bottom of a cold, dark lake. I keep saying his name, but he doesn't respond. Sansa's gonna pay for this. What if the Telethia attack? Then we'll have to fight without Shulk. That's why we've strengthened our defenses. That weapon I made should come in handy as well. We're backed into a corner, but we'll give it all we've got. Can your resistance truly achieve anything? What do you mean by that, Alvis? Exactly what I said. We were all born of the Bionis. Of Zanza. It is Zanza's will that the Telethia return us to the body from whence we came. Whether we die of old age or in battle, we all eventually return to the Bionis. We cannot escape this fate. Am I wrong? You've got it backwards, man. Just because he thinks it doesn't make it so. We decide whether to keep living or not. I agree. Even though he's our creator, that doesn't afford him the right to take our lives on a whim. But that is the thinking of a Hans. He is a god. Such morals cannot apply to gods. So you think we should just shut up and die? If that is the fate decided by a god. You are mistaken if you think we will simply accept such a fate and wait to die. We'll never stop fighting. Not till the end. To Zanza, the outcome is the same. Thus, your logic is flawed. It ain't the outcome that's important. It's the will to fight back. Even if you die in vain. Alvis! 
Whose side are you on? You scared or something? Frightened of a few Telethia? Stop this. There's no point fighting amongst ourselves. <sighs> Fiora. <sighs> Sorry. I need to go and get some air. Hmm. Accents sound fine to me. All of these people are British. All of these voice actors are British. So, I wouldn't really- I don't think they're butchering British accents, they are British. <laughs> Kiss, do you ever play the demo versions of games? Not usually. I have before, but not often, no. There's a side quest to take over there, but we'll do that later. I want to get through all these main cutscenes and get Shulk back and all that. I'm British, we don't quite sound like that. Oh, these people are also British. Then that's how they sound. All of the voice actors in this game are British, I'm pretty certain. So, I mean, you know, not every British person sounds exactly the same. I have quite a few British friends, they don't all sound the exact same. Pete, Liam, Shroom, Lone Wolf. <laughs> 